Hi everyone, this is a short tutorial on how to use the Relic Knights Kickstarter Pledge Manager. If you backed our project, you should have received a link or will shortly receive a link to log in to the Pledge Manager. Once you click this link, you will be taken to a page that looks like this. Um, if you supported a project of ours before, besides Relic Knights, you will see a list of them here. For the purposes of this tutorial, just click on the Relic Knights order. And here you will see my pledge. Um, I haven't paid for it yet, so you can see that uh, my cash amount is minus $100 because I selected Savior of the Universe. I have $0 in credit. I'll get into that in a little while. The Savior of the Universe pledge has two factions included for free, or rather included for in the price of the pledge level, one rule book, and two special edition miniature slots. All right. In this case, I don't need to get any additional uh, double saviors or go to get them out all at this time. The next thing we go to is trading in. So under our announced uh, Kickstarter promotions, we allowed you to trade in one faction for every savior of the universe level pledge. So let's say I want to trade in one faction, but I'd like to keep my rule book. So you can see that the fact, number of factions has decreased by one. The rule books and the slots are the same, and I have fifty dollars in additional credit to spend, which I can do on the next page, where I can choose my optional items. And you will see here that the available items for the items that can be purchased by money, credit, or by slots, they'll be listed. Both will be listed. So let's say I would like a SD Calico Kate. I will choose one Calico Kate. I'll add her. And let's say I want um, a SD Malia. And I'll add her. And you'll see that. I now have zero available special edition miniature slots, but I have the SE Calico K and SDE Mario listed. I still have $50 worth of credit to spend though. So I could spend it on a Void Reaper, which is $20. And the Void Reaper. And perhaps I'll add Cordelia Clean and the Void Herald which is $30 using up all my available credit all right after that's done I have one faction to choose so here I can pick a doctrine faction let's say all right that's done go to shipping info here I enter my shipping information the changes and the total will be listed here and you see this is what I got I traded in one faction I have one additional faction with a doctrine bonus Harbat Rubo, Lithograph, Calico, Calico Cake, Malia, Void Reaper and Cordelia Clean and Void Herald for a total of $100 and from here I can check out with PayPal if you had actually a pledge to us and pay through Kickstarter obviously this subtotal here or rather this total old would be uh, zero because the pledge amount would be a hundred dollars if you just wanted the SDE figures as some of you requested you just need to pick the $50 mercenary charter pledge level trade in the faction and so you have $50 in credit and pick Calico K Sebastian 
Malia, Kisa, Kasat Roto, and one shot. So you will see here that you used up all your credit, and additionally, on top of that, there'll be an additional ten dollars that will need to be charged. So it's quite simple, and everything else is the same as a regular pledge. Alright, thank you very much. If you have any questions, please leave your comments below and we will try to address them as soon as possible.